Now look, um, when I came here... It can make all the difference. I got... I got lonely. Gina, my fiancé is right there. <laughs> what happened last night? Nothing happened. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel once again. Today I'm super, uber, mega excited to be sharing this brand new series actually called Apples Never Fall. You can currently watch it on Peacock, yes, and it's actually a TV mini series and it's a drama mystery. The main focus of this video will to be speaking about the lesbian relationship between Brooke and Gina because let me tell you this storyline is 100 trillion percent worth the watch. But before we get into further details, please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe and also if you have watched the show, let me know your thoughts on it. So basically the series follows the Delaney family whose world is turned upside down with the disappearance of Joy, basically their mother and also a loving wife. Her husband and her four children basically is going through a lot as this disappearance of their mother actually starts to unveil a lot of family secrets. And yes, Brooke is one of Joy's daughters. She's a businesswoman and she is a lesbian who is engaged to her long-term girlfriend, Gina, who is a chef and also has her own personal story in it so at the beginning of the series we don't see much of brooke and gina in this case together but as the series actually you know progresses we can see you know the storyline card like developing slowly but surely and as things develops you can actually see that in this case brooke she is going through financial situations when it comes to her business it looks like business is not going very well and she doesn't want to tell it to her parents because her parents are very demanding people and they always expect the best out of their kids so brooke is kind of in a position that she doesn't want to tell her family and her parents that her business is failing so her long-term girlfriend and also fiance gina offers you know extra money to help the business upload until she you know she can figure it out so they can actually become business partner at the beginning brooke wasn't very you know considering it but also knowing that she can actually lose her business she has decided to accept her girlfriend's you know help so and until that point everything was okay until in this case brooke actually found a text on gina's phone of a worker that actually works for her and it was a photo basically just saying i miss you with her text and at that very very moment brooke started to realize that in this case in her head that gina was actually cheating on her with someone that she works with and of course brooke during that moment she was going through a lot with the disappearance of her mother so she never actually really confronted gina regarding the you know the text and what she saw on her phone she kind of just let things go and as as things develop that's where things actually starts to get very interesting because savannah is a woman who actually came out of nowhere and started to live with joy and her husband before joy's mysterious disappearance once again joy is in this case brooke's mother so savannah is this girl she comes in the picture she's very mysterious nobody knows where she's from we're still trying to figure out that whole situation so savannah and brooke in this case they start to get close and since brooke already know that gina was cheating on her she has decided to take matters into her own hands and also start to in this case develop a a love affair with savannah so in this case brooke was always at her mother's house not only to spend time with her mom but also to spend time with savannah as savannah was living with her parents so that's why that's how the whole situation actually ends up developing but things didn't last long because as the season progresses you can actually see that in this case Brooke's sister actually told you know the police and everybody that in this case Brooke was having an affair with Savannah because at this point when in this case Savannah disappeared you know she actually left and now everybody's trying to look for her maybe because she had something to do with the disappearance of joy so in this case brooke had to go to testify and tell the police why she never spoke about the affair why 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 and of course at this point gina still didn't know that in this case brooke was cheating on her and she actually never had the courage to tell her until very recently so at that very moment after the whole confrontation happened after everybody found out 
out about the affair between Savannah and Brooke. You know, Gina came in the picture and she was so worried about Savannah because she didn't, in this case, she was so worried about Brooke because she didn't know that Brooke actually went to, to the police station and the reasons behind it. So after that, they actually had a conversation and instead of in this case brooke admitting what she did she tried to come basically to reverse things back to gina and that's when gina told her hey i never had an affair with the person who i work for you know it was an emotional affair me and her we never slept together we never did nothing intimate it was just you know we, we were talking a little bit you know out of ordinary but you know it was nothing 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 physical and at that point, you can see that Brooke starts to feel very guilty because she just found out that all this time Gina wasn't cheating on her at all. Yes, she had an emotional attachment to someone because she used to feel lonely, but it was nothing, nothing physical. She actually cut it off and kept things professional between that person. And at that point, Brooke later on also came out clean to Gina and told her, hey, you know, this whole situation going on with my mother i was never honest with you the reason why i went to the police station the other day is because you know they found out that me and savannah we were having a love affair and says savannah is also being in investigated you know and everybody's trying to find her to get more details on the disappearance of my mother they found out about our love affair and I just want to let you know that i also cut it off yes it was physical yes we were together in some type of romantic way yes we used to spend a lot of time together but you know as soon as our engagement came closer and closer our wedding came closer and closer in this case i cut it off and i want to be with you and i'm sorry and of course at that point gina was so disappointed because like wow you are blaming me for something that you were doing is kind of like you know it's very 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 selfish from you because you were distancing yourself from me while you were the one cheating on me physically so now at this point gina and brooke they are separate you know savannah is nowhere to be found savannah has to come in the picture again so we can figure out what was her real intention on actually getting close to the family and actually to see what's what's her reasons as well because we all know that savannah had no feelings for brooke in this case and i feel like brooke at some time some point she also felt lonely and she also did it because she felt like she now was cheating on her so she kind of wanted to get her lead back so right now the couple is not together i don't know if they're gonna proceed with the wedding i don't know what's gonna happen I, I, but it kind of looks like brooke is having second thoughts on marriage i feel like she loves gina but i don't feel like she's ready to settle down so we will have to see how things will develop hopefully gina can you know forgive her some way somehow but you can actually see that gina really really cares for brooke and she really loves her hopefully they can figure it out because i feel like their storyline has a lot of potential so yes guys for further details on how everything developed between them please go to peacock once again and the show is called apples never fall and once again it's a mini series and it don't disappoint at all i and it also got a 6 out of a 10 rating but me personally i will definitely rate it a 8 out of a 10 so yes guys i also activated the super stickers to the channel just in case any of you would like to make a small donation and also please don't forget to like comment share subscribe i really hope you all have enjoyed this video until the next video and goodbye